It's good to be back, guys. It's been a long time, I don't know, a couple months, since I've actually done a review. I'm back, I'm happy to be back. I'm here at the Bernabeu, got to enter inside. And guess what? We won five to two. It was a great win for me. I was excited to see how Real Madrid was gonna play this season, come out playing, and I liked what I saw. I mean, we got to see Cristiano, Cristiano back after his injury, which was great. I, you know, he left a little bit, uh, desire, or us desiring a little bit more from him, but hey, he's been out for a long time. And I think the team overall played really well. They dominated Osasuna, who was a left their opponent but they did give us a scare a couple of times they had two great goals I thought their goals were awesome and they gave they hit the bar they scored one that was called later called a penalty some weird stuff today I think there's a lot of individual performances to focus on I really love the midfield today I love Tony Cross and Kovacic today they did a great job what they what I really liked about them is that they always look to go forward and this is something that maybe not in every single game they should do but today it worked really well they were looking to go forward Kovacic especially is always looking he's very very vertical and I, and I like that because he takes a lot of risks. The defense, the defense for me today, speaking of the defenders, playing offensively was awesome. We had goals from Danilo, Pepe, and Ramos, which was great. And Danilo, I know that we've been very critical of him over this past year, but today he was a star. I love the way that he attacks, and he shoots from outside the box, which is really great, which is how he got that goal. Pepe and Ramos, obviously on corners, they're super dangerous, and when the ball's across in. The offense, obviously Cristiano was back, he got a goal. It was an amazing performance for him, but we did see him playing some significant minutes, which he needs, obviously, after such a long break. Bale was awesome today. I I love the way that he takes that leadership on the field. He works extremely hard on defense. There's a time where he lost the ball and he did not stop running until he won that ball back. He was just missing a goal to complete an amazing performance today. And Morata, Morata, he's sort of that polemic player. I wasn't convinced by him today. There's things that I like, there's things that I don't like, but he is young and he's getting the minutes that he needs. I like the way that he's constantly looking to go to goal, that he's creating space, that he's moving off the ball, coming back into the, into the midfield, looking for those, uh, looking to create with the midfielders. But uh, when he has to finish, there was a couple of goals that I think should have been goals. I hope that with more time that he can improve his finishing because I think if he can put away one of those opportunities in the game, he is going to be a world-class striker. The substitutes today also came in off the bench and did a great job. We saw Asensio come in, Lucas Vasquez and Benzema. I thought Asensio had a great match. He is one of those players that I really like. I enjoy watching him play because he's so clever. He goes forward, slips in those passes behind the defense. He had one almost, that was almost a goal to Benzema. I love the way he plays. So the first half lacked a little bit of intensity, but we got that early first goal by Cristiano, got some other goals in the first half, but the second half we stepped up, deserved the goals that we scored. Overall, there was really good individualistic uh, performances. I think we still have some stuff to improve on. So we're looking forward to Wednesday. We're playing sporting here at the Bernabeu. If you guys haven't done so already, hit like and subscribe and let us know what you thought of this match.